Enter this young fighter here, his kicks as powerful as anyone in the sport at present. And not only that, but he'll do major damage just by landing a couple of them. Oftentimes, all it will take one kick to the body just underneath that elbow or a kick to the lead leg, and you can change the entire complexion of the fight. Very curious to see how it plays out for this powerful kicker in this matchup tonight. This guy has incredible stamina and ridiculous cardio. If his opponent can't slow him down, he is not going to be able to keep up with him. So here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Great combination of speed and power, and the power is really set up by his precision, his dynamic striking style, his timing. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. No one has been more adaptable than this man, Lee, comma, Bruce. This guy has excellent footwork. He's very difficult to catch inside the octagon. He closes the distance well, and he's always in a position to attack and defend. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Both fighters are 31, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, now to get us started, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Robin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. Eve Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 28 wins, three losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Palermo, Tatiago, Jechebola, Ponsonibio. And now we're going to see his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Well, how good is this? Reminds me of the good old days of Pride, the UFC Grand Prix single night tournament. This has been highly anticipated by fight fans around the world. And remember, if you sustain damage, that could affect you later on in this one night turn. Oh, what a jab. Going to the body there with the right kick. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Well, so he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. Kick lands. Big, Big body shot. shot. To the body. Get away. Get away. Get away. 
neither guy really finding their range with much consistency here early. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Slightly deflected. And he gets hit with an outside leg kick. Swing and a miss by Lee. Nice leg kick. Spinning back fist. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Oh, huge block. Good short punch there. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Nice inside leg kick, not even telegraphed. Double jab landed there by Lee. Under three minutes now to go in round one. Here comes that kick. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Punches block. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. Right hand lands. It's not just his speed, it's speed with proper technique. And that's one of the things that makes him so dangerous. And an arsenal of information when it comes to movement. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Just out of range with that left hook. Big kick, but miss. Straight right hand now, just misses. Straight right, he misses. Big left hand there inside. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. When a southpaw fighter is facing the orthodox fighter, it opens up the back left kick for the southpaw fighter, which lands on the liver. It's a very vulnerable area and a huge advantage to fighting southpaw. Under a minute now to go. Forty-five seconds remain in the round. Just missing on the uppercut there. Kick lands. Thirty seconds now to go in the opening round. Straight to the body by Ponzinibbio. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Ponzinibbio's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Almost hits him with that left hook. He landed that inside leg kick. Oh, right hand. Right hand. What an end to round one. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Excellent striking on display in that round. Deep right there. All right, here's some water. Ready? Listen. All right. And you're doing awesome out there. Jenny Andrade to get us going. You ready? You ready? Round two on the way. All right, so second round getting underway here. Competitive first round, Joe. Not necessarily a round of the year per se, but high-level action on both sides. Both fighters had their moments. Your thoughts on what we saw over the first five minutes. Nice kick there by Ponzinibbio. 
lands a punch there, Joe. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Good left hand. A big oh, right hand lands. <laughs> he missed with that jab attempt. Vicious combinations. See the total strikes. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Nice leg kick there by Ponzinibbio. Well, once again, he gets clipped up top, Joe, and again, he continues to show that vulnerability, leaning into his opponent's offense. Gotta figure out a way to make the adjustments, change up the tempo, and get that head off the center line. Oh, hip kick blocked, though, by Lee. Oh, he clipped him there. That one hurt. Ah, uh, he's unable to connect with the left hook, Joe. Oh, another strike lands to the liver here. He buckled him with that exact shot earlier in the fight, and he feels like he can still target that area to great effect. Big overhand right. Montenegro gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Just over three minutes to go now. Roundhouse kick, Joe, unable to find the target. Oh, both men exchange. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Just missed with the left there. Ponzinibbio's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Right idea, wrong execution. No good on the left punch count. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, nice jab by Ponzinibbio. Excellent knee to the body. Pontanibio gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Just over a minute to go round two. Oh. He nailed him with that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. The right hand just misses. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Constantly a moving target. One minute now to go round two. Nice leg Back kick. and forth we go! <laughs> Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Well, he left his head open again there, Joe. He's gonna have to make some adjustments with his corner if we get to the next round. He continues to lean in and move into the strike of his opponent. Not a good look for him defensively here. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. Just misses with a left hook there. Beautiful right leg kick there. Pretty strong jab there by Ponzinibbio. Just a slip there. Shot to the body is blocked. And that's the end of round number two. Here's a perfect head kick. And there's a kick to the body.
There's a powerful kick to the body. Big round. Awesome. I love what you're doing out there. That striking is on point. Okay? We knew this is where we're going to be. So let's get out there and stay sharp. Thank you very much, Carly Baker. Next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fighting. Fainting with that kick. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Look at that. Nice. Total strikes. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Lands a punch. Hand speed, man. Misses with the right hand. Misses a huge hook to the head. That shot blocked by Lee. He faints with the kick. Well, he leaned right into that hook shot, Joe, and that is certainly something that Bear's watching here moving forward. I know he's confident in his chin, but he's a sitting duck there walking right into the pocket to absorb that hook. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Clean with the right hook. Oh! Able to land on the body there with the left kick. Joe. Under three minutes now to go in the round. And he continues to work the body here. Misses with the left hook. Nice punch by Lee. Oh, good hard kick. Effective punch there by Lee. Just out of the range with that right hand. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. With two minutes and change to go in round three. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Under two minutes to go. Oh! He's got to be careful here. He's in trouble. Oh, he might be out. Oh, he missed that kick. Watch the shot here, Joe. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Just misses with the straight right. Nice left hook to the body. Lee's eye is closing up now. Not good for him. How about that chin? Excellent feint with the kick. Nice jab by Lee. Just missed with that huge kick. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. He hurt him! He's clearly hurt. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Hurt him with that uppercut.
Well, he misses with the left punch there. Just out of range with the straight left hand. 15 seconds. Nice jab. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hand. Nice. Punch coming, it's blocked. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. Take a simple look. We're getting too frustrated trying to force these leg kicks. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. Carly Baker in the building tonight. Thank you very much. You ready? You ready? Fourth round now. Fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys got rocked. If they continue at that pace, someone's going to sleep in this round. Well, you got to love this performance here tonight, Joe. He continues to land a high number of strikes just as he did in the previous round and seemingly not slowing down at all here tonight. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Finds his range with the jab. Oh, that's a pretty filthy combination there by Lee. This cut in his face is getting worse. Oh, big right hook, but a whip. So unguarded right into the pocket, and as such, he leads right into that uppercut, left the head wide open, and I'm not sure how many more of those, Joe, he's gonna be able to take. Let's see if he gets the hands up, tries to circle out, and get that head off the center line. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Just misses with the jab there. Good defense there. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. Look at that jab. Nice. And he's looking for that left. Oh, a huge block there. Just misses with the right. Oh! Just over three minutes to go. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Under three minutes remain in round four. Lee gets caught by that straight punch, or so it appeared, Joe. Oh, he got tagged there. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there, really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Just misses there with the left. Kick to the body by Lee. Oh, 
much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Ponzinibbio gets caught with that punch. His chin has held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offer. Wow, both of his eyes starting to swell pretty badly now. Front kick to the face. Just misses with the straight left hand. Final minute. Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Flips to avoid that left. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. Just out of range with that left hook. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Nice punch by Lee. Going to the body there with the right kick. Throws the left hand. Just misses with that one. Ten seconds. Kick lands forward there. These guys are swinging. Huge uppercut misses. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. 20 minutes in the books. All right, that's the end of the round. And our cameraman all over that cut on the cheek. That thing is getting wider by the minute and only getting worse. Cutman gonna earn his money tonight. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Thank you very much, Carly Baker. Well, this cut increasingly becoming a fact. Oh, that looks terrible, Joe. Bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if they call in the doctor and stop this fight. Ponzinibbio gets hit by that kick to the body. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. How about that shin? Oh, a huge inside leg kick for him. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. He clipped him. That one hurt. Nice leg kick. Oh, that's a sharp hook there by Ponzinibbio. He just whips that punch in. We show you the total strikes. Ponzinibbio gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Good shot. Oh, a nice inside leg kick landed there by Santiago Ponzinibbio. And he's down. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Big punch. Power shots landing on both sides. And the chins continue to hold up. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there. And he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Three minutes now to go in this one. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Lee. Oh, that is some severe swelling. I hate to speculate, not a doctor, but you might be staring at a fractured orbital there. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. Kick to the body. Shoots the head kick, but misses. Oh, beautiful hook by Lee. Spinning attack to the body lands for him. Oh! Nice 
nice jab. Try to establish that jab. Beautiful right leg kick there. And just misses with that big right hand. Beautiful straight punch there by Ponzinibbio. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh, useful, well-placed kick there. 90 seconds remain in the fight. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Well, Joe, you gotta fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. Oh, good head movement there. Nice look. Oh, he got tagged. One minute to go in the fight. Oh, and he ate a front kick. That strike will count. Straight right hand, no good. Inside leg kick. Huge block there. Oh, back and forth we go. Oh, head kick. Nice. Lee's cut on his nose is just pouring blood at this point. Oh, nice body kick. Tagged him. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Boom, tagged him again. Oh, he just missed with that straight left hand, Joe. That shot is blocked by Ponzinibbio. What a 15 minutes put forth. All right, so this one will go to a decision, and this one might receive some bonus money as well. Close fight. Both fighters went toe-to-toe -to -toe in the center of the octagon. A lot of significant strikes landed on both sides. We are very curious to see how the judges saw this one. Round three, this thunderous head kick finds its way through the guard. Round four, this is the kick that lands and does all the damage. As soon as it hits, you can see that he's stunned. Round five, slams home this body kick. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-27. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks.